Well, Callan, uh, nice to see you again. Um, how have the last sort of three or four weeks been? You know, you, obviously it's an unusual thing to have a break in the middle of the season. So, so what have the three weeks consisted of? Yeah, it's been good. It's been almost like a mini pre-season, to be honest. The, the intensity of trainings have uh, picked up. We've been doing a lot of running. We've been working on our tactical quite a bit. So, yeah, the boys, have, the boys are really fit going into this first game. Um, against Western, I think we're just all eager to get back out on the pitch because it's been a bit boring without any competitive games. Have you managed to, to do any? Uh, have you played any games against local league sides or played like eleven v eleven internally? Yeah, internally we've been playing a couple of um, eleven v elevens, a bit under fatigue as well, which is good. So yeah. In terms of the way the season's gone, obviously you started the last three games. Um, happy with the way things went on the whole, personally? Yeah, I mean. I'm happy to be starting. Um, obviously, I think I can still be doing better. I think I've been getting caught out a few times, but overall, I think I've been doing pretty well. And I think, yeah, I've just, yeah, I've been going all right. When you look, <laughs> yeah, when you look at your game and you and you look for ways to improve, are they defensive ways, or because you seem to get up and down okay? Is it mainly defensively that you look for the improvements? Yeah, I, th I think it's a bit of both, to be fair. I mean, I'd like to get a few more stats on the board, assists, goals. Um, and then, yeah, defensively, I've been caught out a couple of times. I think, you know, 80% of the time I'm, I'm good defensively, but, you know, just it's those 20% I need to sort out. Yeah, because, I mean, growing up, presumably, you weren't a fullback. You were no. probably a bit further forward, I think yeah. I knew that. Yeah, so, so are you still finding adjustments that you have to make playing, playing in that role? Um, I mean, no, I think I've, I've played right back quite, quite, uh, for a long time now, so I think I'm fairly used to it. But yeah, started off as striker when I was younger and then slowly moved my way back. I mean, I'd still like to be up front scoring the goals, but you know, defending's just as fun. <laughs> and in terms of the this first six games, the tail of the tape is one win from six, but the performances, for the most part, have been, have been better than that. Do you feel like the team is heading in the right direction performance-wise? Yeah, I mean, performance-wise, we've been okay, but I mean, at the end of the day, it's about getting the three points and, you know, the, the boys over the last few weeks have been really working hard and, you know, like I said, we've been going over our tactical side of things a lot, so I think if we keep going this way, we'll be getting more wins down the road. What's it been like actually being a normal football team that lives in a city that it plays in, trains, travels? every other week. What's it been like being normal? Yeah, it's been super nice. I mean, last season, yeah, we had our own place, but we're all in the same hotel. You know, we didn't really get away from each other or seeing each other every day. So it's nice to, you know, be able to go home, do our own sort of thing, you know, take our minds off football a bit. And then when we are in training, we're fully switched on. So yeah, it's a massive help being back. And then we've got this new facility here, which is, you know, top of the line. So yeah, it's been, it's been nice. And who's going to win the uh, World Cup? I'm going to... I'd like uh, Argentina to win, you know, just so Messi lifts the trophy, but I think Brazil's been looking a bit too good, to be honest, so I think Brazil might get the win.